What's up guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to yet another FCPX tips and tricks let's get started after this quick intro welcome back and I hope you guys are enjoying the new intro and new episodes of Final Cut Pro and well in today's episode we're gonna look into something basic but yet very powerful so you might have been working on Final Cut Pro from a year or so and you might have downloaded a lot of transitions effects and titles and uh, you don't want to miss that out if in case if there is any incident of software crash or if you have crashed your laptop or you just want to migrate your to a new laptop and you just want all the transitions effects and titles and generators on your new Final Cut Pro. So in this video we're going to learn how we can take a backup of all of these transitions, effects, titles, generators. So without wasting much time let's hop into the system and check it out. Alright so in order to take the backup we got to do two steps and number one we got to go to finder and find the path where all of our titles, generators, compositions, effects are residing and number two we got to see how to take this backup and which are the folders which are important to take a backup of so let's go to finder and press shift command g that will bring up the option where you can go to the folder directly by entering your folder path so you can just enter slash users slash if you do not know the path of it and click on go that will bring up the accounts which you have on your on your Mac machine. So I have only one account and one shared account. So I'm and my Final Cut Pro is residing on Man of Mysore account. So Man of Mysore is my channel as well. So go ahead and subscribe to my channel and go to this folder and go to movies folder. Inside the movies, you'll be able to see motion templates folder there. So motion templates folder is the one where you will have all your FX generators, titles, transitions and compositions. So this is the folders which will have all your FX inside and generators and uh, titles here. Yeah. While you are installing, you will be pretty sure about uh, how to install it directly. So I'm pretty sure most of you guys will know about it. But if not, I hope it would be helpful. So yep. Yeah. Go ahead and copy this and uh, you know save it in some sort of a, a hard drive and uh, yeah that's it it's pretty simple straightforward but when something goes wrong with your Final Cut Pro or your machine this thing would be lifesaver so go ahead and back up this uh, folders so that was very simple but yet very efficient and powerful one isn't that so I hope you learned something out of this video and if it was helpful do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching and talk to you guys on the next one. Peace.